Hey Lauren, I'm back with another video. So today I'm going to share with you my two week update of wearing my retainer every night and even during the day for a few hours and the progress of my teeth and um, yeah. Um, I just want to say that my teeth feel so much better as far as like um, when I close my mouth and I speak and um, it's not my overbite isn't like out like it usually is if that makes sense I don't know if you can tell now but that's the bottom so I, have, I still have a little gap right there and, and I just, I don't know, I'm just amazed at the progress that I'm making. Um, when I first put them in, there is a little bit of like discomfort when I put the wires in, like towards the back when I, when I um, snap it in and it hurts for about maybe five minutes and then there's almost like a numbing and then no pain so I just want to tell you um, with my experience that if you do wear it consistently even if it's just throughout the night or even if it's you know six to maybe eight hours maybe ten hours even if you do that every single day, the pain of the pressure of your teeth moving will eventually subside. Um, if you are feeling pressure on one or two teeth at a time, that's because it's shifting, it's, it's, the retainer is moving the teeth back to its original position of where your braces left them when you had them removed. So. Um, the only pressure that I'm really getting on one tooth right now is this one. I don't know if you can see it, but it's, um, that one right there. And it's like on the back, it's like, it's like overlapping. So it's. It's like this. I don't know if you can see that, but it's like that just a little bit. So that's the only discomfort that I'm really getting. Um, but like I said, after like five minutes, the pain is gone. And then you get like, it's almost like a numbing in a sense, but there's like no pain whatsoever. Um, so it just feels comfortable when I wear it. And when I put it in, it's not, I don't have to like shove it in like I did before. It was like the first, I could say maybe first three days, I had to shove it in. And um, if I didn't hold pressure for a little while, they would pop out. Even when I spoke, even when I would open up my mouth, even if I would just, you know, just move my jaw or whatever, just any type of movement, it would, they would pop out. So, and that was on both the top and the bottom. But, um, we're going to wash them. I just put them in here. I just brush my teeth because, you know, I wanted to do that before I got on the camera because, you know, that's kind of, yeah. Um, YouTube, I just, I just opened it. Okay. 
make sure that you clean the wire too. Because that can hold um, that can hold um,
it's like when I feel it, it's like it's completely straight all across. Like there's no like overlapping with this tooth anymore. And then you see like a little gap and there's just a little overlapping on this tooth right there. But other than that, it looks so much better. So I am excited. So this is the bottom. Top. So much better, and it's not a struggle to put them in anymore like it was. So it's getting them. It was no pain when I put them in. Um, it's just it just goes in comfortable, and that's it. So this is my two week update, and um. I'm so so gonna need to talk here. <laughs> it's gonna get better. Um, but anyway, I could talk without it popping out of my mouth like it was. Um, but this is up for my two week update, and I'll come back at the end of October to do another update. So two weeks from now. Okay, thank you for this video, and um, I'll see you guys in the next one.